Wow, okay, we got the Woj Bomb. So we got a couple trades here, I believe it's two or so. Let's jump into the first one. So, as right now, we have seen a trade regarding Nikola Vucevic. And Nikola Vucevic is the all-star center for the Orlando Magic. He's actually going to be shipped off to the Chicago Bulls. So overall, the Chicago Bulls land Nikola Vucevic and Alfaro Camino for Otto Porter, Wendell Carter Jr., and two first-round picks. Wow. So the Chicago Bulls are still in pursuit for Lonzo Ball, and they picked up Nikola Vucevic. We've already known the Chicago Bulls that Otto Porter Jr., he had an expiring contract for around 28 mil. He had to get out of there. Wendell Carter Jr. was an okay piece, but you know when you have Larry Markin and Zach Levine, you got to make a move to keep Zach Levine happy and build something around him. So this is a good move if you're Chicago. I mean, you had to give around two first picks. So, I mean, it is what it is. We already know what the Orlando Magic, they're trying to rebuild and blow it up. Maybe we'll see an Eric Gordon trade come here pretty shortly, but this is good for the Magic. That you're blowing it up. You get two first round picks. You get an expiring contract. And Wendell Carter Jr., you can have him for a year or two. Maybe see if he grows with his potential or you can, you know, send him off and all that. Uh, for the picks, which there are two of them, the Bulls are sending the Magic 2021 and 2023 first round picks within the deal. It's crazy, crazy. Um, we do have a mini trade as well. The Denver Nuggets are acquiring JaVale McGee for Isaiah Hardenstein and two future protected second round picks. So Cleveland is requiring or is acquiring a 2027 unprotected second round pick and 2023 protected second round pick through number 46. If you're the Nuggets, this is a move that had to be made. You are able to get another big out there, more depth, and JaVale McGee. He's, a, he's probably one of the most underrated centers out there. A three-time champion. He started on championship contending teams. And, I mean, he's a great defensive big with his wingspan and being seven feet or so. Another trade. We do have the Detroit Pistons are trading DeLon Wright to the Sacramento Kings for Corey Joseph and two second-round picks. Um, it's a mini trade. It is what it is. DeLon Wright is an underrated combo guard in the league. In Sacramento, which they're not going to make the playoffs or anything, but you know that's that's a good deal for them. Two second round picks are nothing. Corey Joseph, I believe, has an expiring contract. If not, he has another year. And Delon Wright would be a good fit for their team. Nothing too crazy upon that trade right there, on that side. Um, another trade did go down. The Boston Celtics are going to obtain Evan Fournier for two second round picks. So the Orlando Magic have hit that rebuild and blow it up button with Nikola Vucevic, now Evan Fournier. Evan Fournier is going to be a great fit for Boston. He's going to fit the culture. He is 6'5 as a shooting guard. Actually, my bad. I think he's 6'7 as a shooting guard. He's going to give him some great length offensively and defensively and another sniper from deep. So this is a good pick for them. This is a good pick. I like that. Um, these are the deals as of so far. We'll cover a little more. There's going to be some more Woj Bombs. We'll jump in.